All right, welcome back to another episode of Dead Space 2023. I'm Cat to Beefy with the Game Vault, and we are on the Ishimura. We're looking to manually light the engines. We just dealt with the centrifuge, which, uh, if you watched that episode last time around, resulted in several deaths because I think I've lost a step in the last 15 years. So, let's get right to it. Cue the music. So we gotta ignite these engines now. And of course there's a bunch of dudes in here. Alright. Take out some legs. Quick as we can. Oh, loving it. Engine power failure. Replace power cells to begin ignition sequence. Oh crap. Let's finish you. Get that flamethrower ready. Those fuckers handles are nasty. Clear? Alright, we're clear. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Oh no. Out of bullets again. I say bullets like the French, you know. We are out of bullets. Right, there's all the plasma energy. Take that. Warning. More. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Oh look, they must have had some COVID up here. Alright, so we're gonna need to pull a power cell, put it in there. Is that what we're gonna gotta do? Let's look around this room a little bit. The violence is not over yet. I can tell you that. Look at the blood, man. It's just this game is so rancid. If video games ever get to the point Warning. where you can smell power what's happening, Replace yeah. power cell to begin ignition I'm sequence. Done. Right. Let's just keep looking around a little bit, see what else is around here. We want to gather as much loot as possible. Hopefully some more bullets. Okay, that's where we need a power cell. Warning. Keep giving me that plasma Engine power joint. failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. I'm guessing that's the cell up there. Probably is... Oh! I guarantee as soon as I pull it out... Or, eh, it should be alright. Usually when you pull it out of something, it creates... Uh, this time it'll probably be when it comes in. Yeah, I see you. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, I lost my head. <laughs> A lot of dudes in this room. Alright, well, we totally pooched that. That was horrible. Absolutely horrible. Ishimura. got this. We'll go ahead and use this this time. Stairs yet, but we will. Right, there is no duties back here, right? Yep, nothing here. Warning: engine power failure. Replace oh. power cell to begin ignition sequence. We'll take that puppy. That's not the proper way to Warning. treat a battery, but... Engine power failure. Replace oh, power cell to begin See that? I thought that was a creature. Alright. That's that up here. I thought we could get up over here, too, can't we? Yeah. Anything? Ah, okay. <laughs> Plasma. Some more schematics. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin Let ignition the sequence. Do the talking. We do, buddy. We do. All right. So we're gonna we're gonna prep up a little bit here. Replace full. power cell to begin ignition sequence. Let's look at our. Uh, see, we got too much of this crap. We got a bunch of schematics. We got stuff we got to sell. All right. Well, we're gonna have to. Be ready for this. Warning. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Anything else? If you're smart, and I mean SMRT, you 
prep up for these big fights. We should be able to take out a few of these guys real quick with these things. Warning. Engine power don't failure. run out of uh, power. power to begin ignition sequence. Right, let's see what's going on over here. Nothing. Ignition sequence initiated. Please stand by. Thing better about it was we survived it. This machinery is just so deadly looking. Sabotage the fuck out of these engines. You bought us time to figure it out. Ooh, Autopilot's taking buddy. us into geostationary. This is family channel. Wait, wait, you're flying us through the planet crack debris? That's what the asteroid defense system is for. But the ADS is offline. I've got the system readouts here. Hammond, the Ishimura is in rough shape. A couple of bad strikes could finish her off. Shit. Daniels, give me all the data you have. I'll try to adjust course. Isaac, take the train from engineering. Meet me on the bridge. I'll lift the station lockdown. We need to work on this together. All right, buddy, I'll meet you on the bridge. So the asteroid level, God, I remember that from the original game, how awful it was. It was just absolutely horrible. It took you out of the game. It was like totally, <coughs> excuse me, it didn't vibe with the rest of the game. The controls were awful. <clears throat> keeping the uh, again, keeping it above the whole integrity above thirty percent or something like that. It was just so hard to do. So I heard they completely revamped it for this game and made it into something worth doing, where you go outside, 
of the ship, you're at zero G's with no oxygen. You know, we, you know what oxygen you have in your in your tanks and all that, and that's what you use to. Uh -oh. <clears throat> that's what you use to take it out. <clears throat> Losing my freaking voice here. Yikes. Take that at least. Sure. Here at my store, it's supposed to be safe, bro. stuff now. Okay. Jellified hydrazine for the flamethrower. Okay. Bring this part to the bench to extend the upgrade path and gain access to a special upgrade. It's for the ripper. Flamethrower fuel. Ripper blades. All right, let's go ahead and we're going to sell off the gold semiconductor for how much? 3,000. Thank you. And we'll sell the bronze semiconductor for 2,000. We have one node. Storage. Let's go ahead and change our look again. Let's go for the boring look. Alright, we'll do that real quick and then we move on. Made a little space in the inventory at least. Uh, we need a workbench so that uh, we can install the stuff that we do have. <clears throat> and that will that'll help us out at least a little bit on our storage problem. Buy a node? No, we don't, because we'll probably, like I said, find another suit or something. We're gonna save off for now. We're gonna be cheap. I know. Just making sure we didn't. Shop. It sounds like a place that would have a bench, right? See one real close, so to get it. We'll move on. Cargo lift. You know what? We're getting way too many of those. So what we're going to do, we're going to go back to the store. And we're going to put the Ripper into storage, I think. So... As well as this stuff in storage. I don't mind the flamethrower for those little guys, and, and all. That should 
at least take a little bit out of uh, the randomness of our drops and give us more. Yeah, because we need more for our uh, laser here. Music makes you think there's a creature there, doesn't it? I'm waiting for one to be in here one day. Alright, let's head to the bridge. Lining is locked. There's the bridge. That's locked. Mining's locked, but engineering's open. Okay, let's go to the bridge. Man, look, you can track your progress on there. That's kind of cool. Nice, it's all bloody. I seem to remember this ship being a little bigger, but maybe it's just... I played, um, I played through this one, played through the, the second one, loved it. I think I liked the second one even more than the original. It just felt, it felt like it took everything from the original and built on it and made it better. Whereas the third one kind of got away from what made the first two great. And one of my biggest beefs with the third one, besides that microtransaction crap, Isaac. Was we're looking the at the ADS missions. They were awful. Mess. I'm going to need your help. I am not losing the Ishimura. Not now. The Ishimura Hammond or the Marker? That artifact they found? Don't bullshit us. CEC knew all along about the Marker, didn't they? Isn't that why you're really here? Corporate wouldn't send the Ishimura for some off the books mining. But alien technology, yeah, that fits. And how does losing my team fit into this theory? Hey, knock this shit off. We're into the debris field. We get the ADS back together, or it's over. Then meet me at the captain's nest. Daniels? Fine. But I'm going through the ship reports, Hammond. I'm getting some answers. Uh, plot twist. Daniels is a little suspicious. Of course, we get flame trouble. Damn it. Lots and lots of credits, which is great. That's cool, huh? Our 20, 20, 24, 43. That's cool. Alright, we can't go there, so we only got one way to go. I think we're about to hit that asteroid field. Or the debris field, whatever you want to call it, but it was like that was so bad. Let's do a quick little save here. Alliteration imminent. hit one up, so let's go to the main atrium here. And this is definitely a fight. Containment measures activated. You okay? Oh, 
I remember I this. Containment and life support are holding. So far. Containment. What are we containing? Yeah, this big set. Look at this place. This is so freaking gorgeous. Walking around here. Bust open a few more boxes. It's one thing I've learned in video games. Let's look around for the boxes. And these kind of request retrieved. Security coming! We've been boarded! I repeat, the ship has been boarded! We are under attack! They killed most of the deck staff. Where the hell is Steve Vincent? We need security back up now! Guns are useless. We what in God's name is that? Well, that did not sound promising. I'm gonna go out on a limb here and guess that things went south pretty quick for these guys. This has got like echoes of like John Carpenter's The Thing and then um, uh, that Horizon, it's classic horror movies, sci fi horror. Does it so well. Hi, sir. All right. Shoot. No, no, keep that rifle close. What is that? The one that attacked me. I managed to trap him in here. Is it's that this. that hunter dude? I'm not seeing things right. That's Chen. He can't help him, Hammond. He's. You're right. I should... the hell with it. Escape pod 47 launched. I worked with him for years. Man, it just yeeted him. Johnston too. At least you spared becoming a monster. We're gonna fix this, Hammond? For them? Yeah. Come on. The ADS cannons. I can hold this position for a while, if no more asteroids come through the roof. Alright, looks like we got some stuff here. More text logs to read later. Here. All I can tell is the ADS power routing is shot. Well... The administration systems aren't doing much. We could redirect power from there. I'd need to rewire the junction boxes, but we get the ADS cannons back. Good. Isaac, about what Daniel said. I don't know about any illegal mining or the marker. I swear, I'm just here for a repair mission. Look, Hammond, I don't know you or Daniels well enough to judge, but CEC had to know about the marker. The company made one, but shit like that's above my pay grade. Look, we can get into it later. You'll need a way down to those junction boxes. You can turn the atrium elevators back on from security. You'll have full access. I found a CEC executive key card. I'll upgrade your clearance. And you upgraded yours already? Yeah, just in case. And Isaac? I heard something up there. Something big. Watch your back. Gravy. Alright. Off to activate the elevator, I guess. Here. Okay. 
feeling things are about to get real. Lifted, great. Well, here's some boxes. Let's see what we got in here. Level three security clearance required. Oh, come on. Clearance confirmed. I really don't want to waste money buying ammo, but I might end up doing that here before long. This is kind of getting crazy. Or maybe I should shoot better. Crisis, you've cut us off. By Maritime Law Article 5469, I, Dr. Terence Kine, hereby declare Captain Benjamin Matthias unfit for duty. Hold him. Ben, you're not yourself. Let me help you. Traitors, get your hands off me! This is my ship! Oh my god, he's. You. Ben. You saw I was trying to help him. Doctor, you Struck just him in the eye? Captain. We have to take you in. I can't. But the others from the church get a hold of me. Stop! Well, that was kind of messed up. Alright, let's go ahead. Work this bench a little bit. We got two nodes. We'll hit this one first since that'll give us points afterward. Back to the plasma cutter. Unfortunately, we gotta get a reload speed, which isn't the worst. But if you plan your reloads okay. It's not the not the best. Now, I don't always plan my reload. I try to reload, but. Let's get in here. I think we're going to be going outside. Uh, where do I want to go? 4 1? 4 2. Save, I know. 
I don't want to have to backtrack 20 minutes. Welcome to Mining Administration. Storage room. Let's go in here first. Exiting vacuum. Oh, we're out of the vacuum too. That helps. All right, and the stasis moved over. Where is it? I'm reading electrical hazards on the floor ahead of you. 60-year-old dead plane it doesn't play well with power surges. Watch your step. Contact beam yet, but now we do. Great design, huh? Alright, well, let's see what this one does. Fire asteroid cutter heavy energy projector that launches a continuous lethal beam. Big recollections of this area. Fuses. Okay, let's look around here first. You gotta kind of avoid those electrical surges. suit first. Because the extra ammo capacity is not going to help us. We don't have any friggin' ammo. And now we got a fourth gun again, so it's going to make it harder to pick up our ammo. Buddy. Oh, I'm 
yourself up. Feels like the gun from the uh, original. So. Just got an update. Power diverted from Mining Administration Network. That's one. We still need more power. A couple more systems should do it. I thought I heard some creatures. Yeah, we're running, we're running. we got going on in here. some of the electricity.
crazy, huh? wrap up this episode of Dead Space. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault. Thanks for joining me today. If you haven't done so, please leave a like on the video if you found it entertaining at all. Watch me die and be horrified. And don't forget to leave a... Um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And ring that bell for notifications. I do videos daily. And I appreciate you guys dropping by. I'll see you next time. Until then, peace.